Hi Presidians, we're going to give you a little bit of a tour today to see our future home. We also look forward to bringing you here in person, but for now here's a brief video tour to show you some of the buildings, classrooms, and beautiful natural spaces that await. To my left we have Scott Hall, where we have several classrooms as well as the student lounge. This is one of the larger classrooms in the building, and it will also be getting a technology upgrade in the summer. But as you can see, it's a beautiful space right now. I love the round tables and lots of great natural light. Here we have another classroom, room 102, slightly smaller, but still very nice with some technology already. Again, technology upgrades coming this summer, as well as a beautiful natural light. One nice thing about this classroom is it opens to another classroom, so there's flexibility with these doors here, and it could be one big classroom or two smaller classrooms. We think students will really love this space. It's a student lounge. There's space for kitchen area use, there's space for resting, there's space for studying, and it's gonna be open not just at residency, but all month long, daytime and evening for you all to come together in community. Our new campus is 19 acres here in San Anselmo and Marin, and it's a really inspiring natural setting, which we're so excited about. It's gorgeous views everywhere you look. This venue here is actually one that is very popular for weddings, and you can see why based on the natural scenery. There's also a really cool labyrinth right there. Uh, we can just imagine the events we'll be able to have here, parties, orientation, graduation over the years, and we're also looking forward to it being a home that our alumni can come back to and celebrate as well. One of our students had a great idea this term for a small lending library, and we're really looking forward to now being able to have a legitimate real library. We don't yet have Presidio books in here, but we will, and it will be another great resource for our students next year. Uh, you can take a look. This room will give you a little bit more of the history of this campus. It was founded in 1876 as the San Francisco Theological Seminary and recently has been partnered with the University of Redlands. You still have beautiful resources like this uh, for interfaith services and community, should that be of interest to our Presidio students. In addition, this is a space that we can also use for speakers or events like that. Behind me is Montgomery Hall, where the Presidio team will be housed. It's also a beautiful natural setting out here. I, Envision students loving to meet in their teams and just enjoying nature breaks in between hours of residency. You can also see that there's a parking lot. There's ample parking here, which is great. There's also bike parking. What's not quite as good as public transit is not as good in Marin, but we'll be working with students to figure out the right alternatives to make it easy for all of you to get here. We're about to show you the dorms. There's also a few other residence options for students who choose to live here year round. And these dorms might be dorms that you would consider coming to stay for the residency weekend. This is the living room area for the dorms where students can hang out, evenings of residency. There's some games, a piano. We're really looking forward to making this space a welcoming community space for students to feel right at home when they come to classes. There's a lot of different spaces inside and out for folks to relax and study together and just have some fun together too. Here's a little kitchen in the dorm area. Could be fun to think about some community cooking and meals together if people don't want to go out to the town of San Anselmo. Here we have an example of a dorm room. There are both singles and doubles. Um, it's, yes, it's a dorm, but you know, this is some part of the fun of going back to school and being together. Uh, for students who choose to stay here, it'll be totally comfortable. There are several great housing options on campus. There's a lovely B&B style type house for faculty to come and stay during residency. This house is called Trinity House and 22 students can stay here together during residency weekend. Uh, some of the furnishings may seem slightly dated, so we're going to do a little bit of updating for you all, but this is a f an interesting option to consider if you all want to stay in community in a space that's not quite the dorms we just saw, but more of a house feel. The university also owns several houses on campus, a few of which were designed by my favorite architect, Julia Morgan, and one of which was the original home for Presidio World College, our preceding institution, and it is such a special thing that we can come back to our original founding roots at this point.